Your guide to the sport of harness racing is the Trotting and Pacing Guide, filled with more than 300 pages of facts, records, and other key information. It's the true insider's guide to harness racing. Be an insider and order the guide online at shop.ustrotting.com or by calling 877-800-USTA. It's July 4th weekend. We're here in Goshen, New York to honor the newest class into the Harness Racing Hall of Fame. Tim Rooney, Tom Crouch, and Alan J. Levitt. Also going into the communicator's corner, Leon Zimmerman and John Barry. Also, Miss Easy and Muscles Yankee are the horse inductees. Let's go inside and check it out. Tim Rooney has been a harness racing titan, both as a prominent breeder and president of Yonkers Raceway. His patience, I guess, and his perseverance have paid off in New York and returned it, New York State harness racing, to prosperity. But he also comes aboard as a breeder, an owner, uh, he breeds thoroughbreds, uh, you know, it's, it's, he's a very unique individual in that and very deserving. The one thing that is interesting, I think, it, it, what's going on at Yonkers and a lot of places in the racing world is that the lottery a number of years ago nearly put us all out of business when they came in and we lost 22% of our business. You know, since then though, in the last couple of years, the lottery through giving us slot machines at Yonkers, and I think everybody here knows the results of that operation. Breeder Alan Levitt revolutionized the standard bred sport, first with Lanelo Bell Farms and then with Walnut Hall Limited. I think his biggest comp contribution is taking Garland Lobel and Amor Angus out of Quebec and, uh, you know, coming up with Andover, Angus and Conway Hall and it just put a new perspective on trotting bloodlines and that, that effect is going to have uh, a, a profound impact on the breed for generations to come. F. Scott Fitzgerald famously said, there are no second acts in American life. But in my case, he was wrong because I have had a second act, which was a priceless gift to me from my wife, Meg. And it's the reason I'm here tonight. Breeder Tom Crouch has produced some of the sport's top trotters and pacers with Kentucky Anna Farms. I think it's very well deserved. Uh, Tom's been in every aspect of this business, from owner to breeder to sales com company operator to stake sponsor and, uh, and you name it. And uh, he's excelled. He's bred a lot of great horses. I wouldn't be here tonight without my partner, of 49 years. No wife ever sacrificed more, and I said this in Vegas, and I'm going to say it tonight. No wife ever sacrificed more for her husband to live his dream. Betty, thank you. 